Meteorologist Laura Hartman has the morning off, but she didn't start her weekend without giving us another one of her excellent science experiments. Now, I'm not just blowing hot air, at least not this time at least. See what Laura can do with a plastic water bottle and a balloon. Take a look. You've seen the combination before, vinegar and baking soda. Together, they can be explosive. So we're going to play with them in a different way and use them to blow up this balloon. All you need, baking soda, vinegar, an empty water bottle, and a deflated balloon. We're going to start with a third of our water bottle already filled up with vinegar. And I've got about a tablespoon of baking soda. We're gonna try and fill up the balloon first. So I gave it a few good stretches. You can use a funnel or an at-home one made out of paper. Put the end of the funnel into your balloon and funnel in the baking soda. Now is the tricky part. We're gonna try and put the balloon onto the water bottle lid without actually putting any of the baking soda in just yet. Okay, we've got the balloon on top. What we should see now when I put the baking soda in with the vinegar is a chemical reaction and we'll start to see the balloon inflate too. Ready? Oh! Okay, that is awesome. So what we just saw there was the baking soda combining with the vinegar. They have a chemical reaction and as they do, they produce heat and that blows up our balloon. It feels a little bit on the warm side if you actually touch the top of it. And if we slowly let this go, there goes all of our heat that we just put into our balloon. If you want to learn more or see this experiment again, just head to 13onyourside.com.